Guys, I'm He-Man. <laughs> MTU. Today, we're gonna watch some scary mother videos. Hopefully, hopefully, I will get scared. I don't think so. I don't know, it hasn't been very good. I tried to find the good ones, but they don't come along. Not really. But let's see, we're gonna watch some top mother five. This is gonna be good. Good vibes, good vibes. God, show me some scary stuff, good vibes. Come on, top five. You can do it. Good vibes, good vibes. Number five. This scary CCTV video of a woman's paranormal encounter went viral in 2016 and has been freaking people out ever since. What I wanna know is, <clears throat> do people actually have CCTV cameras in their bedrooms? Perhaps. What kind of sh they be recording? Interesting stuff, isn't it? Let's see if this is a real possession attempt like they say, or if someone Ooh, is merely pretending possession. their house is haunted. <laughs> it looked like she did it with a leg. <laughs> Watch the corner of her pillow. When a ghost opens the door, the corner of her pillow moves by itself, almost like there is a string that's running behind her pillow to make it look like the door opens by itself. And instead of a ghost pulling the covers off, it looks like she could be pushing them down with her leg. The scary noises caught on camera could be made. Damn, like, I don't, I don't. <sighs> Chills, man, he knows you. <laughs> He's seen enough of these videos. Number three. Julie, Kelly, Emily, and Liz are the ghost moms. Ghost moms. <laughs> Bloody hell. I guess ghost hunting is so, like, easy accessible now. You can just buy shit off Amazon. A paranormal investigation team from Kansas who are mothers by day and ghost hunters <laughs> by secret night. Secret identity. Mothers by day. Secret. Ghost hunters by night. Tonight they are extra scared though because the ghost moms are exploring an abandoned haunted prison at the Missouri State Penitentiary, <laughs> a place in a where prison. their motherly charm is not particularly useful. It's really scary not being able to see anything but through the camera. <laughs> Sounded like mother rats. Can you touch that ball? <laughs> I bet they be touching some balls. A scary loud noise from another cell demands their attention, and so they place a music box on the floor to see if anything is there. What? <laughs> Why did they take a music I box to your prison? Like, like a it's music box is more of like, so you go to a haunted house really and you're in a child's room, <laughs> you know, really the elderly woman's room or something, but you go into prison you're putting music boxes in people's cells. Like, what the f***? They are scared because somebody has to be turning the handle to make the music play faster. I mean, if they can turn a the music handle all by themselves, then you might as well take like a, you know, iPod with a Beats speaker and, you know, let them pick their favorite songs. None of the ghost hunters are near the object. It goes faster <laughs> by itself. Come on. You guys are doing that. Get high tech. What the f*** with the music box? Oh, the rim pod's going off, oh. Julie. Rim pod just went off. Their equipment detects a ghost in the hallway when none of them are anywhere nearby. So that's bizarre to say the least, if not paranormal. Maybe it was a rat running by, but I think we all know. What's she digging for behind the toilet? Uh, she's got a hand like all the way behind the toilet. Uh, and it's a prison toilet as well. Uh, what the f It's not your home. It's not one of your kids who left the big on the side of the toilet the prison one of them hears God, what they think is a scary people. whispering voice followed by a fit of laughter was it an evp or was it one of her fellow ghost hunters that just sounded like one of the moms number two Adam McIntyre travels from Ireland to London to investigate the Woodrow High House and immediately the door starts like opening and closing. Yeah. <gasps> no, I'm actually scared. Wait. There's literally no draft here. Wait. The better, better go in there. I don't like it. Oh, 
Don't scream. Oh my God. This is my bedroom corridor, so I don't want her. Hold on. <laughs> They're supposed to be his quarters, uh, but the door, the sign on the door says unisex toilets. Wait, is he sleeping in the really toilets? Scared, like, so they I don't, don't, go I don't know right what's away, going on here. But they do briefly explore the room from the door, and I don't see anyone standing there. Yeah, it could be as behind the door. stand breathlessly outside, it becomes more than apparent that an apparition does not want to let them in. Number one, police in the Indian city of John C stand perplexed as gym equipment rises and falls by itself with no one touching it. That is that is weird. Cause this, we've got these like outdoor park gyms, and they they're literally there's no um, electronic part to them, and it's it it's literally like just it's mechanical. You just if you put in the effort, it's gonna move. But that, that is just weird. Plus one what of the is going is on? Better resolution, and it doesn't look like there are any strings attached to the equipment. No strings gonna be able to pull that. It's gotta Police be ropes. Later said that a hooligan that is crazy. the equipment Holy to make it do this. This video was apparently so scary that you and I can't handle them. Well, I got through it just fine. We'll catch you in the next one. Safe. So so we need we need a bro fest or something. We I know what we'll do. We'll do the Eskimo. Nah. We'll do one of those. A bro click. Yeah. How about this rock paper scissors? How about some bro? How about a bro elbow, elbow, bro elbow. Anyway, take care. <laughs> well, do you a bro elbow, 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 elbow.